is Jasmine. I blog, vlog, make videos over at runjasminerun.blogspot.com and I'm doing this little video as an introduction for the month of March people who inspire segment. So this month, month of March, month of spring, hopefully, because it's really cold today, bring back the 60 degree weather. Um, this people who inspire interviewee is my good friend, Megan. Megan and I met through, I was thinking about this last night because I wasn't sure exactly, but I want to say that we met through a uh, running club that my husband and I tried to make when we first moved here from Florida. Um, we, I was having trouble finding other people to run with because he you know, was working a lot longer at work, so we weren't able to train like we used to together when we lived down in Florida. So I created this little running group and actually met a lot of people in my town from that little running group before it kind of disbanded. Um, and Megan was one of those people, and I just really enjoy running with her. She has such a great, you know, personality, super optimistic, and um, always in a good mood, which is nice because myself, another female runner friend, and Megan, we all run together on Wednesdays. Uh, BTW, if you ever want to, if you live in our town and you ever want to, like, come run with us, please do. We love the more the merrier for running in uh, on Wednesday morning. I will link that information <laughs> somewhere on my page or on Facebook. Uh, but back to the introduction. Um, but yeah, every Wednesday morning because it's you know in the middle of Tuesday and Thursday, which happens to be two workout days for myself, I get to see Megan and our other friend Danielle, and they they both equally are you know always in good moods and just lift me up on Wednesday when I'm hurting from whatever workout that I did the day before. But anyways, Megan is um, like amazing. I just learned something. I mean, Megan, you're already amazing enough, but I did learn something while we were um, running together uh, that she happens to have Crohn's disease. And I'm gonna be honest, because I like to keep it real. Um, I didn't know exactly what Crohn's disease was, so when she told me that, I went home and I Google searched it. And when I read what Crohn's disease was and the symptoms and signs and things that you have to manage along with Crohn's disease, I was like, how the F word does she run? Because I just, it, I was just like, wow, that's incredible. Um, so she talks about it in the interview, how she manages it, um, how she... Uh, you know, found out about it. I don't want to give that away. You guys can go ahead and read that. But um, yeah, it's just, it, it makes me really appreciate her even more so as a runner friend, as a human being. And maybe because she sheds light on training with Crohn's disease, her interview is something that someone out there in the universe, internet world can read and be like, hey, I have Crohn's disease. I want to be a runner. If Megan can do it, I can do it. So thank you again so much, Megan, for being open about sharing all of this and also letting me interview you and also being awesome on Wednesdays and putting me in a good mood when I'm hurting from my workout on Tuesdays. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this intro video. Please enjoy Megan's interview. Also, she has a blog. So go, go send her some, some love on her blog, okay? All right, guys, thanks for watching. Enjoy Megan's interview.